stopped raining in the temple town at the moment, but there's still heavy waterlogging in several parts. This after incessant rains yesterday, which led to several roads being waterlogged and pilgrims being stranded. Now, most pilgrims have been rescued. One of the routes to the temple has also opened up. Though there's still a rain alert at this point in time, one person is also have, uh, is, uh, like may have uh, fallen into the drain. Uh, search and operations are underway to find him. It is heavy rain in Tirupati. Most of the areas around Tirupati have come under water, even though it has not rained uh, since uh, uh, yesterday uh, night and early morning today. Several water logging in several areas have not receded. And as the water is being discharged from the nearby reservoirs, we are seeing several uh, areas are completely under water and people are very much confined uh, to their uh, residence. And we are seeing few have to wade through uh, this water and as the water is being uh, discharged from the reservoirs uh, we can see the uh, how forcefully the water is running in the streets uh, here in Lakshmipuram and locals uh, demand that the government should immediately uh, start the work to pump out water from the uh, low-lying area and more importantly as far as the Tirumala temple is concerned yesterday uh, there was heavy rain we have seen uh, there have been uh, uh, roads caved in several areas so the traffic uh, stopped in several years. But today morning, as, uh, as the uh, climate also have uh, improved, now the vehicle movement is allowed in one route is what we are uh, hearing and with the one hour waiting time. And now the devotees are being allowed to offer prayers also. And yesterday several uh, devotees were stranded in the temple and all, the, all of them are being rescued uh, gradually as the uh, vehicle movement uh, in, uh, in the routes to the temple have eased up. With video journalist Vijay Mugilan for Mirror Now.